Hey folks, so this is a double sad. Not only is this my last battle with this team, but this is my last doubled battle with PBR. So I'm using my Jane team in random Wi-Fi. My Jane team is my um, mostly NU doubles team. Uh, it was designed for creativity, um, and it really didn't do as well as I was hoping it would. Um, but you know, I've had I have had some really good matches with it, and um, I'm just hoping you know. I went on random Wi-Fi hoping to find a, a good opponent, and my opponent is using no Ubers, which is nice, but it's a very uh, OU whorish team, uh, using a lot of the Pokemon that would definitely be an OU if there was such thing as doubles OU. Um, so anyway, uh, at least I'm going to get to uh, see this team off in one of my favorite Coliseums, Waterfall Coliseum, it's just so beautiful. Um, and I lead off with my original lead combo, Soul Rock and Lantern, but looking at his team, um, I think that I really can waste no time setting up, and I really just need to go ahead and attack the first turn. Both of his Pokemon are, well, that's not true. Metagross is going to be weak to Earthquake, and Roserade doesn't have the best defense, so switching out Lantern uh, will probably be the best move. I go ahead and switch in Licky Licky, who's got great defenses, so can probably take that Earthquake. Um, Soul Rock goes ahead and uses Earthquake, hits both of his Pokemon, um, does, I uh, get them each down to about a quarter. I'm actually really surprised that, um, Soul Rock went first. Uh, it kind of tells me that neither of his Pokemon have invested in speed. Um, so, Roserade uses Giga Drain, um, does about a quarter to Licky Licky, um, and it's going to recover back to about half health, so, uh, again, tells me a little bit about its set. Uh, Flash Cannon gets a crit. This is a very interesting uh, Metagross set if it's running Flash Cannon. You don't really see uh, many that use Flash Cannon. Anyway, that's going to take out uh, Soul Rock in one hit. Not sure if that crit mattered. And I'm going to go ahead and send out Mr. Mime because I know that both of my Pokemon are faster. Uh, or sorry, not my, both of my Pokemon. Mr. Mime must be faster because Mr. Mime is faster than Soul Rock. So anyway, I'm going to go for Psychic just to take out Roserade. I did consider doing the Teeter Dance, but, you know, that's too much relying on probabilities, and I really just want to take them out. Um, Focus Blast should be able to uh, KO Metagross at that range, or at least so I'm hoping. Um, so yeah, Mr. Mon goes ahead and uses Psychic, uh, and that's obviously going to take out Roserade. And so now the match is tied up again, which is nice, and I'm thinking maybe, maybe I've got a shot, depending on who the rest of his team is, or the team that he brought. Um, so Roserade is taken out, and Metagross is going to go ahead and use Hammer Arm, and I'm like, okay, well that's it for uh, Licky Licky, and alas, it is all there, all she wrote for Licky Licky, um, really was completely useless in this match except for uh, Sponging Damage and Death Fodder, um, so that's sad. Uh, anyway, my opponent's now going to choose this time to send out Dragonite, I'm like, oh god, how am I going to take out Dragonite? I think, okay, well, Lantern's not the worst option, I have Ice Beam on it, right? Uh, but I don't have Ice Beam, so what I was, what I, um, was originally going to do was um, Signal Beam against Metagross and Ice Beam against Dragonite, but I don't carry the Ice Beam, I carry the Hydro Pump and the Surf. So, yeah, Mr. Mime's going to go ahead and go for the Psychic. Um, does practically nothing to Dragonite. Dragonite, uh, my opponent obviously made a misclick uh, with a T-Wave, because even if, you know, uh, my opponent was a noob, didn't know that Lantern um, had Volt Absorb, uh, you know, why would you make it even slower? You're obviously going to be faster, useless. Anyway, um, Dragon Claw luckily doesn't do very much to my um, Mr. Mime, so it's probably not invested in... Uh, in speed, not sorry, uh, in attack. Anyway, I get a crit on Dragonite, which is to which totally I needed, and I take out that Dragonite before it's actually able to do something good. Uh, luckily, it wasn't even running extreme speed, and this time Lantern's Hydro Pump is gonna hit. So I've turned a um, three-two uh, lag to a two-one lead. He's only got uh, my opponent's only got one Pokemon left and I'm just hoping that I can take it out. It's a Gengar, which normally I believe would outspeed my Mr. Mime, but his team obviously isn't invested in speed, so Mr. Mime is able to KO in one hit with a Psychic, and that is the game. So Jane is uh, leaving this, uh, leaving PBR on a whim, uh, on a win, and uh, that was absolutely incredible. So um, it's been a rather tumultuous uh, you know, few months with this team, um, but I liked it, and, uh, you know, stay tuned for the tribute.